So today I got a couple of paper shredder that uh, I want to modify and shred my plastic so I can recycle and make new parts out of it. Both of these paper shredder are capable of cutting tray up sheets. Previously I did a hack on this uh, 16 sheet paper shredder and it can cut very thick plastic. The problem is uh, the 16 sheet uh, shredder is very expensive. Uh, these are less expensive. So today I'm going to try and have these two trail sheets paper shredder and try to cut uh, my plastic here and see how thick these can cut. Both of these paper shredders are made by the same brand and it is made by Royal. Now let's try on this one first. I already removed the screws on the bottom so I'm just going to show you the inside. go here is the closer look and it's got plastic gears too rest of gear is metal on this side here is the cutting blades let me show you the difference between the 12 sheet paper shredder and the 16 sheet paper shredder the striking difference here is the motor size. This one is quite small, the 12 sheet shredder. And look at the motor on the 16 sheet shredder. It's a lot bigger. And there's also a difference between the part where you feed the paper on the 12 sheet shredder. This part here is quite big compared to the 16 sheet. It is smaller. So what that means is, on this one, I don't have to cut my plastic into smaller pieces before I can fit it in. There's a couple of metal bars here, but I think that can be removed. And here it is. I've just removed the two metal bars on top of the shredder. Now I got a bigger surface area to feed my plastic in here. I cannot feed my plastic through this small hole, so I have to run my shredder open like this and it's easier to feed my plastic in here and in order to do that I have to bypass a few security features number one is the switch for the bin and number two is the switch for the paper feeder now there's a switch down here for the bin so that when you insert the bin it will turn on the switch and the shredder will not run when you remove the bin because when you remove the bin this switch will be turned off on the top here we got a paper feeder switch so when you feed the paper through this hole here it will turn on the switch right here okay and that will tell the feeder that there's paper coming in and it will turn on so here is the bin switch this is just a momentary switch and on the top here we got a paper feeder switch and this is a very simple uh, contact switch so when you feed the paper in two contacts will be touching and it will turn on when the paper is gone we'll release the switch and it will be turned off so here we go I've just done with the mark and here is the bin switch I've cut it out I just tie the two wires with a wing nut so it's permanently attached so that will fool the shredder into thinking there's a bin in there for the paper feeder switch I've extended the wire and connected to another switch this is a latch on and latch off switch so when I turn it on it will lock on it's not a temporary switch now let's try and turn it on see if it works ready You can see when I turn off the switch, there's a delay about 3 seconds. What that means is when you feed the paper in and when the paper has gone through the switch, it's about still about that high above the cutter. So it has to wait for like a 3 or 2 seconds for the paper to go through all the way before it can turn off. Alright, moment of truth. 
first is the water bottle. You gotta cut it in half so it'd be easier to fit in here. Very nice. Next is milk bottle. Check out milk bottle. That is not good. And it does slow down quite a bit. So let's try one more time. Second time, still not good. Third time. Third time, still got something left. Let's try the fourth time. So here it is, after four times of cutting, still have big chunks left. This is not good for melting. I have to cut into smaller pieces than this. Well, that's kind of disappointing for the 12 sheet paper shredder. I'm gonna have to go back and use my 16 sheet shredder. And I'm gonna cut this and show you the difference. Let me show you the difference here. This is just one cut, that's it. As you can see, the 16 sheet shredder is a much better quality cutter than this. The only downside is that the feeder is a little bit small. Actually, it's quite small. I have problem trying to feed in my uh, bottle, but once it's in, it's gone through pretty good. And this trail seat shredder, even though it's got a big opening, so it's easier to fit in the plastic, uh, it's got problem cutting the plastic. And I think the main difference here is the blades. Take a look at the blades here, and it's, uh, it's a lot thinner than the 16 sheet shredder. This is a much better quality blade. And also the motor is a lot bigger. Here's the second 12 sheets paper shredder that I showed you earlier. And it is upside down so I can show you the blades. The blades are exactly the same. And the motor I assume should be the same because this area here is the same size as that area. So this occupying space here is the motor. And it looks exactly the same but I don't have to remove it because it's exactly the same made by the same company so I'm not gonna try this because it's gonna be exactly the same result as that one so overall this is my failed attempt on this trail sheet paper shredders but I did learn a few things from this experience number one in order to cut plastic you need a good quality blades 
like from this one here this one is not going to cut it literally and the only thing this can cut is this that's it and another most important thing is the size of the motor you can see there's a striking difference between the sizes of the motor this motor is about roughly three times the size as that so you can see in the video this one here can cut through the milk bottle just fine no problem at all while this one here was struggling that's it for now folks if you have any suggestion of what I can do with this juice shredder besides cutting this bottle please write in the comments below I would love to hear from you right, thanks and I'll see you next time